to Girl Talk World. Today we're with one of the most influential writers ever, it is Jacqueline Wilson. Thank you. And we're here because you have a brand new book coming out on the 4th of October and I wonder if you could tell us what it's about because it's a big one. <laughs> it's called My Mum Tracy Beaker and it's about Tracy grown up and she's a mum and the story is told by her daughter Jess. Tracy is a wonderful, very loving mum, but she can be mega embarrassing at times. And she does still have a royal strop occasionally, but never at Jess. Jess can do no wrong in Tracy's eyes. So how similar is Jess to how Tracy was as a child? Well, <clears throat> Jess looks exactly like Tracy, only she has little tiny glasses but she's a very different sort of girl. She's much quieter and she's real bookwork. Jess can stand up for herself and get really cross too. So there's a little bit of Tracy in her, but she's slightly easier to deal with, I think. Does Jess like to write as much as Tracy? She does like to write. She, she has, I'll, I'll tell you this, she, because to start with, they're not allowed to have um, dogs in the flats where they live. Mm -hmm. Jess has imaginary dogs. Oh, cute! <laughs> four! <laughs> four dogs! I'm glad they're imaginary. I mean, imagine fitting them all in a flat or going out for walks. Exactly. Just be dragged around the park. <laughs> <laughs> and did you reread the old ones in order to write it? I should have reread them. <laughs> I, I, I think the story of Tracy Beaker is part of me and so I, I felt, I mean I glanced at it, um, but I felt I could remember. If there was any really pertinent fact, I did go back and check. I thought about what Tracy would be like now and got used to carrying sort of Jess around in my head and just went for it that way around. And do you think there'll be another book in another few years? Um, maybe. <laughs> I'll wait and see. <laughs> okay, so we are going to play a game with you today and it is called All Grown Up. So we have a bag here full of Jacqueline Wilson's characters from your books as children and you have to pick one out and tell us what you think might happen to them in 20 years. Who have I got here? Oh, I have Floss, Flora in Candy Floss. Well, what's happening to you? I think in 20 years' time, um, I'm not sure that Floss will be working in a fun fair <laughs> um, as she, she ends up in the book Candy Floss. Um, but I think she'll still be very, very close to her dad. Um, I see her with several children and they all have that wonderful curly hair. Mm. But I think what Floss will have done, will have, she will have gone to Australia and met up with her mum there. Okay, what's this one? Ah, this is Shirley in Wave Me Goodbye. Well, Shirley will shock her mother by becoming a bit of a rebel and um, she will be right at the start of the swinging 60s mm -hmm. and she will start wearing mini dresses and um, I think, now she, she's very much a bookworm and likes writing, I think she might be working on a glossy magazine and she might even have started to interview pop stars for the magazine. Yes, I, I see a really glamorous um, future for Shirley. Ah, it's Marty in The Worst Thing About My Sister. Now this is easy peasy because Marty absolutely loves drawing cartoons and I think now Marty will actually write the most amazing best-selling graphic novels. She will really, really be successful. Um, she will still be close 
to her sister Melissa but they will still actually get on each other's nerves at times because <laughs> Mutt is so, you know, such, that's fun but sort of untidy and funny. Whereas Melissa, Melissa will live in a, a beautiful house, it will all be beautifully polished. If Marty has got children, um, Melissa will get quite fussed because I should imagine Marty's children. Maybe she will have several boys and they will all love playing football <laughs> indoors or whatever. <laughs> <laughs> Melissa, who will have a little girl, very girly, just as she was. Thank you so much. It's oh, so exciting to hear. So excited to hear what these guys are doing in 20 years time. You can find out what Tracy Beaker is doing in 20 years time because the new book is out now, My Mum Tracy Beaker. Thank you so much. You're welcome. Bye. Bye.